Hi, this is Nolan from Benchmark, and in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to set up a base on an averaged point. So before the video began, I've obviously opened up this Field Genius project, and I already set up my base profile. If you want to know how to set up your base profile, I'll just link to a video in the top right corner. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on Select Instrument on the left here. That's going to open up my instrument selection screen. And in my instrument selection screen here, you can see that I have a profile called Hemisphere S631 on a tripod. That just so happens to be my base station. So I'm going to click on Connect here, and that's going to initialize the Bluetooth connection. And as I said, I already had this profile set up, so I don't need to make a new Bluetooth profile. But when my instrument profile opens up here, you're going to see that my communication's already set, as I said. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to set up my antenna height. So if I click on antenna height here, I am going to need to have the measured height. In my case, I measured 1.8 meters, but not to the bottom of the antenna mount, but rather to the slant height mark. So I'm just going to select that as my measure point and hit OK here. That's going to bring me back to my reference profile. What I'm now going to do is set up my reference position. If I click on that, I'm going to have the option that is set to known, and that is if I have a known position. But as I said at the beginning of the video, I'm doing an average position setup. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to select observe, and you're going to see here I have a solution of autonomous, some 30 odd satellites, and a PDOP of 0.9. And what I'm going to do to start my average is hit start. And that is going to start taking an average of several epochs here. I'm going to wait till I've got about 10 epochs for the point of this video. If you're setting up in the field, I would recommend doing something around 50 points. But once I have 11 in my case selected here, I'm going to hit stop and then done. It's going to ask me to save my point. I am going to save it to my job. I'm just going to create a new code here and call it my base point here. So I'm just going to search or add a code here. I'm going to add base, done, and then hit add. I'm going to save my code here and click on done. And you can see I'm now brought to my map screen where I've saved my point and I have finished my setup and I'm now ready to disconnect and continue on with my rover setup. But for now, that is everything in today's video. That is how you set up a base over an average position. And if you have a moment, I will please ask you to hit that subscribe button down below. It really does help us out and helps me keep making these videos. And if you have any questions about anything you've seen in today's video or any questions about anything you've seen on this YouTube channel, please give us a call at 1-888-286-3204 or visit us on the web at bench-mark.ca.